This is a disclaimer for all you youngling out there who get offended by words such as <laughs> and so if you'd rather not hear adult language, please click away now. Other than that, welcome, grab a drink, make a sandwich and enjoy the video. Ladies and gentlemen, how are you going? Call of Duty Infinite Warfare has introduced what can be a game changer. What can perhaps revive Call of Duty. This right here, tactical TDM, boots on the ground, team deathmatch within Infinite Warfare. Can this, can this revive Call of Duty? Is this a complete game changer? Let us see. Alright guys, here we are, tactical TDM on Terminal. Now hopefully this can change the way we play. Ready? You don't know what it is? No boosting, no boosting. No boosting. But I think you can, you can still wall run a little bit. I'm not sure how much, but let us see how on earth we can go with this new game mode. I honestly hope to God that it fucking revives Call of Duty, that it, you know, keeps it from absolutely smashing into the ground, the depths of hell. It Right away, it feels completely different. Hello? But at the same time, as awesome as that as this is, it's probably also going to allow camping and all the usual shit. What kind of spawn is this, huh? Yup, you can go away. Got us a cool little double kill right there. Oh, yes, that is what I'm talking about. The good old jump shot. I don't know where I'm shooting. Oh, fucking fist in the face. I can already say this is way more enjoyable than the actual, you know, jetpacks and everything. The, the thing about this is I really honestly hope it is not a thing. Like over the weekend, you know, it, I hope they it's implemented into the game for the rest of the duration of the game actually until the rest of the cycle Like I really hope they do keep this in because they've done really well at fucking everything up lately And I just hope I really just hope for once They See all the positive feedback on this game mode and you know don't change anything and I also want to address that with my previous video I mentioned you know Supply drops in Modern Warfare Remastered. You know, I just straight away assumed that it was going to be the worst fucking thing on this earth. I did my further research, as people usually probably should, when they want to make an argument on something. Oh, that would have been so cool. Yeah, and it just turns out that it mostly, like 90% of its camos and all the accessories, emblems and whatnot, I'm going to die. So with all that said, that's kind of fine. I'm not too bothered about that, but if they do like variants, if they add variants into it, man. <laughs> I just can't. Aha, you're a bitch. Fuck off. Ho oh ho. Now, I can positively say this is making the game better. If they change it, which I fucking swear to God that they, I hope they do not. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Nope. Oh man, this is, this is so much more enjoyable. I'm g knew it was gonna get shot. I'll chuck in a couple gameplays for this. I'll maybe maybe one more after this. Oh fuck! There we go. First game, 62 to 100. We got uh, 27 to 21. What is my team doing? What is the rest of my team doing right here? What are you guys up to? All right, first game. I'm enjoying it. It's so much better. 
Um, the whole aspect, the just rem just removing the jetpacks itself is a complete game changer. And I honestly hope that people take the time out to play this. I think I have enough for a rare, so let's just open it. Um... <laughs> Good evening ladies and gentlemen, my name is Zach Wallace and I'll be your captain for today. I would like to inform you that my second gameplay did not record as courtesy of my PlayStation 4. So to replace that, here is what you missed. I'm gonna get fucking angry already! I'm gonna fucking lose shit! Alright guys, here we are. Third game, I don't believe the second game I recorded actually recorded. So like, this could be the second game, depending on how it works. What the fuck are you doing, cunt? I just wanted to make this video, you know, quickly for you guys, showing you guys there's a new game mode. And I honestly think it's a game changer. I hope that it can revive Call of Duty in the fucking depths of the swamp it is at the moment. Oh man. This is what it- this is one of the down- this is- this is the con of fucking this shit. But you take one thing, you're gonna get another thing in return. We've got these. It's just a matter of finding where they are. If I fucking die straight away with them, I'm gonna be one salty little prince dick. I died with them. I died with them. <laughs> I fucking. They're, f they're just waiting like little bitches. Yeah, like now that they've got this, it's just gonna be full of campers and. Fucking proners and fucking. Why can't I get any kills? Why can't I not get any kills? Why can I not get kills? Why can I not get kills? Why can I not get kills? Fuck you. Oh, as soon as I. As soon as I get up. Fuck off, yeah. We got positive 16, 15. That's as good as we're gonna do, I suppose. Alright guys, I will end the video right here. Personally, I, I think it can be a game changer. I think it can help Call of Duty get back up. As long, as long as they don't, I don't know, as long as they just don't ruin it. As long as it stays in this game until the end of the cycle, until the next Call of Duty comes out. I think we have a fair chance of getting back. The amount of wall running you can, I don't understand why they left that in there. It's kind of pointless. If you can't have any boost, you can't you can't even really get to A to B. There's no really no point in even wall running at all. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're excited about this game for more boots on the ground action, be sure to leave a thumbs up. If you have any feedback at all, be sure to leave it down below. Also, one week I am announcing the winners for my giveaway. So if you want to be in the draw for that, be sure to stay active on my social media and also my YouTube. Be sure to share it around with your friends and family. And if you're good enough, I'm gonna select you to win. But to know if you've won, I'll simply just message you on Twitter. If I don't follow you on Twitter, be sure to just leave it down in the comments and I'll add you. I'll follow you. That's coming in about a week's time and I can announce our winners and our prizes. I can talk privately with you guys about prizes you want. But yeah, thank you everyone for watching this video. Thank you again. Thank you for 120 subscribers. A couple days ago, I was 90. We've reached over the 100. I am confident that we can stay over the 100 mark. I don't want to fall back again, but hopefully we can stay over and just keep going, keep growing. So thank you everyone for all your support, and I'll see everyone in the next video.